Hi Hello. friends, thanks for being with us today for the show. I'm Haley Harmon, this is Lee Cruz. You're watching Live with Lee and Haley. A uh, big show planned for you today. We're gonna paint with uh, Ollie Cade. Yes, Ollie Cade Designs. We're gonna do some painting with them and we're excited about it. I took a sneak peek in the green room. It looks like they have something yeah. that has our logo on it. So I'm excited. Um, and then we're also, today's half off dining deal is more than cake. So we're gonna be trying out some of their sweet offerings today, which is gonna be good. Yeah. We had a good day today because we, we went and visited our friends over at the Justin's uh, House of Bourbon. That's right. You've probably been like us and driven by it a million times. Right there on Main Street. Yes, right, yes, right north of downtown in Lexington. Um, and we drove by it, and every time I drive by it, I think, and What is that? What is that place? The heck is that? What is it? Is it a liquor store? Is it a bar? What is it? So we finally found out today, and we had the best time with the Justins. There are two of them mm -hmm. at Justin's House of Bourbon this morning. If you're a collector, if you just like to drink, yeah. and there's Lee. Yeah. But anyway, so it's really cool. If, really cool. So if you're a dude, you'll love it. I mean, I think ladies will love woman. it too. Yeah, okay, but it's designed by dudes for dudes. No, it's not for dudes. They yeah, didn't say that. Yeah, it is. You're right. Trust me. Only half the world or more is female. Alienate us. I'm not alien. You can come along if you want. I'm really? Just Thank saying. you so much. They've got a speakeasy. They do. There's a lot of dark colors. It it's is just, great for it guys. Feels, I feel like I got a shot of testosterone when I was in there. Yeah, which is good. You've been depleted. Right. We've low all, T. We've all noticed it. You suffer low, from low T. Low T. Uh, but anyway, we had the best time at Justin's House of Bourbon, so watch for that story coming up soon here on Live with Lee and Haley. But yeah, today we got more than cake and Ollie K Designs. Well, now here's a quick Valentine's Day gift idea. Yeah. This is a hand and body wash and lotion from Fork and Melon. Get this out. I'm actually going to put some on. Thank you to the friends at Fork and Melon who sent us this. This would be a great Valentine's Day gift idea for your lady or man this or is, anyone else This in your is life. made with organic, toxin-free ingredients, including watermelon seed oil, which no. is delicious. What have I done? And to learn more and to order your own, log on to forkandmelon.com. What's that smell like? Oh, it smells good. Uh. <laughs> yeah. It's just hand I'm and body. Alive now. Oh, that smells nice. It does smell good. It is very, um, what is it? It smells like organic. It, it is organic. To me, it smells like Fruit Loop cereal, which I love. Well, they're going to love that. They are going to love that. That's yeah. not what they were going for, but that's no. what they got. It smells organic, not like Fruit Loops. It smells like organic Fruit Loops. <laughs> All natural. All natural. So, yeah, great gift idea. Check them out online. You can go to their websites. All righty. Thank you, guys. All right. You're ready to roll the hot topics. Let's do it. Here we go. Hot, hot fire. <laughs> topics. A picture showing two Missouri paramedics going above and beyond the call of duty is going viral. Oh, wow. Called to a crash Sunday involving a Metro bus, driver needed to be taken to the hospital. Paramedics pushed the patient nearly a mile up an icy hill to get her to the hospital after their ambulance got stuck. Oh, my god! Two men said they had no idea someone had taken their picture while they were going up the hill. How about that? That is amazing. I mean, paramedics, all first responders. I Fantastic. Mean, they suddenly become your biggest champion. Oh yeah. If you're save lives every day. Yeah, that is amazing. So thank you to all the first responders out there. Definitely. Twitter users are criticizing Will Smith as genie in the upcoming live action what? Aladdin. Who knows what? Too blue? Get over it, people. The trailer debuted Sunday night during the Grammy Awards. Fans got a look at Smith's character back, character back in December, but said he wasn't the blue hue that was in the animated movie. Okay. Oh gosh. After the trailer aired, Twitter fans say Will Smith. Smith is too blue as well. Smith tweeted to fans that I told y'all I was gonna be blue. Y'all need to trust me more often. <laughs> Genie is blue. Now suddenly something's too blue. Something's not enough blue. Get over it. I don't. I, I'm suspicious that uh, what you're seeing there is not Will Smith at all, other than the face. It's he's right. CG'd yeah, on top doesn't... of an animated, computer generated effect. Yeah, I don't think that. Was I don't think that's a Will. Costume or, yeah, yeah, I don't think that's Will's back. Or his front. I think it's just his face. And I'm sorry, has there been this big faction of people that forever has been like, oh, Genie is only one shade of blue. And if anybody even tries to be a different shade, Don't I'm going to have to speak up. appropriate genies. Yeah. The, as they say. Because they're yeah. real. They are real. <sighs> Barbara Eden. You know, it was a scandal. Uh, because I think what? it was the first time that they showed a belly button in I Dream of Genie. <gasps> oh. And it was a big scandal. I, that matter of fact, they may have prevented that. 
Yeah, I'm aroused sure. just hearing about it. Really? Yeah. That's all it takes. Yeah. As stores are pulling a line of shoes created by Katy Perry after backlash, critics say they resemble blackface. Oh, no. The styles called the Rue Face Slip on Loafers and Aura Face Black Heel Sandals are now off store shelves. Loafers come in two colors, neutral and black. A high heel version in gold and black. Both designs feature blue eyes, a triangular nose, and bright red lips. Katy Perry is apologizing. <laughs> Well, the only thing wrong here is well, it's that an ugly shoe. they're ugly. <laughs> they're That's, ugly. They're, they're ugly. They're offensive to everybody. So, I'm glad. Why would anybody wear those? Yeah, man. You know, uh, Katy Perry got criticism because of her performance at the Grammys. I don't Why? know if you saw it. No. She sang, uh, which is my favorite Dolly Parton song, and I've always had this theory. Here we what? Yes, that one. Here you come again. Yeah. Looking better than a body has a right, right to. to. Yeah. So she sang that with somebody else. I don't know if it's BB Rex. Casey Musgraves. Casey Musgraves. Love That's her. Okay. So those two sang yeah. it, and yeah. Katie tried to do all the vocal gymnastics. Oh. While the other girl just sang it normally. Yeah. And Katie's. Some people were criticizing that she was trying to upstage the other girl. I, you can't win. With you can't people. win. Why Although would you? it was a little over the top. I watched it. I didn't watch it. Maybe I need to watch it before I form an opinion. Well, you know, anybody that kicks nuns out of a convent, I don't know if I can root for them. Do you have all the facts on that story? Yeah, she tried to kick nuns out of a convent. That's what she did. Physically, she actually tried to kick them, and it was all like, what? Why are we doing this? If they don't want you in the convent, why are you taking it over? What if she wanted to be a nun? Is Katy it's Perry a nun? It's too late. Hmm. Katy, love you, girl. But we can all agree Dolly Parton is a saint. She is a saint. We love her. Girl can do no wrong. And Casey Musgraves, I love you like her. her. Okay. I love her. All right, so there's a little girl that's going viral enjoying a snack of sour cream and onion chips. Yes, honey, I feel you on this. But she's that. using imaginary dip on the front of the bag. <laughs> <laughs> she repeatedly dunks her chips into the dip that's pictured on the bag. She's loving it, though. She doesn't yeah, seem to uh, notice so good. or care yeah. that it's not real. So many times. Who hasn't done this at one in the morning, yeah. two in the morning? You're leaving two keys downtown <laughs> and you are living for these potato chips. Yep. Honey her and, child. Her and David Hasselhoff. Her and David Hasselhoff. <laughs> yeah. It's a 